Hi, everybody. Oh, what was that all about? <laughs> well, the other day I had some comments on my video when I was saying that I, I wanted to lose a little bit of weight because I was eating all those ice cream sandwiches and I had some people comment and saying, don't fall into the diet culture and don't do your body shaming and... Uh, wait, wait, wait. Let's hold on a minute. So first off, I'm not trying to train anybody how to exercise <laughs> or saying anybody needs to look better. I'm saying I was tired of breathing heavy, walking up the stairs to my bedroom. I was tired of having to stop when I went for a walk to feed the ducks. I was having a hard time breathing. And that's when I knew I was starting to get too heavy. I was 230 at one point, and I'm, I'm only around 5'9", so I'm not a tall guy, and 230 is pretty heavy for me. Especially when you think that I've had three lung surgeries, right? So I just, I'm not trying to body shame anybody out there. You do you. You be you. I'm not doing, I'm not going to you and saying, hey, uh, what's going on with you? Why aren't you losing weight? has none of my business. You do what you want to do. Uh, you live your life. But it got to the point where I was, you know, I don't need heart problems as I'm approaching 60. I don't need to have breathing problems. And I wanted to feel better going on a cruise. I wanted to feel better when I travel. I wanted to do things that if I let myself get out of shape, I might not be able to do. I might not be able to hike up that mountain. I might not be able to zip line. I might not be able to do a lot of things. So that's my personal choice of why I'm doing it. It has nothing to do with fat phobia or body shaming. I, I never even, it, it's for me. It's not for anybody else. And if you notice on this channel, I just talk about my opinion a lot. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it's just an opinion. It's what I wanted to do. And I wanted to, I wanted to show you and let you update. I forgot to let everyone know how I'm doing. Now I did my video there on my ice cream sandwiches on, I believe it was June 7th. And I started saying, okay, I finished off the ice cream sandwiches. <laughs> And I started the next day. So my next day, I weighed 193 pounds. So on the 8th. Today's the 16th, so it's 8 days later. And I weighed myself this morning, and I'm 177.5. So in my math, that's 5.5 pounds. I'm down in 8 days. So uh, not a bad start. Right? I, once I hit that 190 mark again, I got myself, hey, you're, you're starting to climb too fast. And I was climbing fast. And I also wanted to show people, I said, you know, when I, when I was first thinking on doing this, I thought about doing a video. And I was going to try and follow a exercise person on YouTube and try and follow their routine to lose weight and get in better shape and things like that. Follow somebody who does this for a living. I'm just, I'm just trying to figure it out myself. Uh, I know how to diet pretty well, but I don't, I'm not an exercise guru by any, yet I know I can't lift weights too much and I, can't, I know I can't jog and hit the treadmill because of my lung capacities and my lung issues. So I needed something that's very low impact like aerobics, right? So I. I was watching YouTube and there's this, this, this young lady called uh, Chloe Ting and she has, uh, she's blown up on YouTube because a lot of people do her, you know, 20, two week shred challenge or do this to lose weight in four week kind of challenge. Uh, get your abs in this and people will do her videos and then they'll do videos on I just did the Chloe Ting, Ching, Ting or look, the Chloe Ting challenge and I said well you know what like everyone as soon as I searched exercises and that she came up and it went all down the list and I said oh, okay so I'm gonna take a watch and she's a very sweet lady very very nice uh, very pleasant uh, easygoing person to watch 
So, you know, it, there's nothing like hardcore. You got to do this. Come on. Rrr, work, work, work. So I said, you know what? I'm going to try it. And so <laughs> this is me right after doing her warm up video. This was the video that is just for me to warm up before doing the exercise videos. And, 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 and look, look how I, I felt. Okay, I, uh, I just did the frickin' warm-up. The warm-up. That one. <laughs> and I'm already out of breath. I haven't even started the exercise yet. What did I just get myself into? That's right. I was completely out of breath doing a 10 minute warm up exercise video, which didn't have like a lot of running and a lot of jumping in place and a lot of anything. It was just simple movements and I was out of breath. And then people message me and say, don't, don't try and lose weight. Don't try and do this. You're falling into the cancel, the, the culture of fat phobia and body and no, did you see how much I was struggling for my air? Do you see how uncomfortable I was? So I'm not doing it for you. I'm not doing it for that person who's saying I'm body shaming them. I'm doing it because that scared me. Being like that scared me going into my 60s. Because I'm a young at heart person. And I want to be able to do the things that I think I can do when I was 20. And I know I can't, but I should be able to breathe and walk. And if I can do anything that helps that, I'm going to do that. And so, yeah, I'm down 40, I guess, three pounds now since I did that video. And I'm hoping to be down to 50 pounds at one point. And I figured that's a good weight. It's not too skinny, not too heavy, and I'm comfortable at that weight. So I, yeah, for anybody out there who thinks I'm trying to shame them, uh, no. Am I not allowed to do something for myself, for my health? If you're worried that I'm trying to shame you, why are you trying to shame me for trying to help my own health condition. It doesn't make a lot of sense, especially since I'm not an exercise guru. I'm not a person putting on exercise videos telling you, let's work out, everybody, come on, let's go. That's not me. I'm telling you how my life is in some places and what I'm doing to try and help myself, whether it works or not. I've had lots of things I've done in my life that have completely failed. <laughs> and I'll be the first one to admit it. But yeah, yeah, come on. Not everything out there is trying to put somebody down. And because one person is doing something doesn't mean you need to take offense on it. I just found that. And you think, oh, Don, how many messages did you get? I had over a dozen people saying I was body shaming and fat shaming people. And if anything, I was just shaming myself. 